this is no ordinary Friday that we are looking at. It is Black Friday. For those of you who might not be aware, Black Friday is synonymous with shopping sprees. It means attractive discounts and deals. The idea has gradually spread from the United States. Festival shopping begins around the time of Black Friday in the U.S. It falls a day after the U.S. holiday of Thanksgiving. Shoppers begin their Christmas shopping during this period. And Black Friday is described as the biggest shopping day in America. It is a festival of sales. But it's not exactly an ordinary Black Friday this year. Far from it. It's a gloomy one, to say the least. Thanks to the dark clouds of inflation looming over. According to some reports, in fact, over half, that's 51% Americans, will pull back on spending this Black Friday as compared to last year. But why? In one word, inflation. They rather spend their money to cover their day-to-day -day expenses, the immediate concerns, save money for emergencies, pay for the energy bills, save gas, save money for the gas for their vehicles. Things are looking bleak for the world's biggest economy. Soaring inflation has left a cloud of uncertainty hanging over the shopping season. Let's rewind a bit here. The COVID-19 pandemic triggered factory closures. There were product shortfalls, shipping backlogs. At this point in time, now that the world has largely opened up, the industry is looking at ways to not let the shopping spirit be dampened this time around as well. Holiday imports are up which could mean oversupplies in some parts as well, especially at a time when there is uncertainty over whether consumers would even want to open their pockets and spend. And this is at a time when the savings cushion appears to be shrinking. According to Moody's, after $2.5 trillion in excess savings in mid-2021, the benchmark fell to $1.7 trillion in the second quarter. The National Retail Federation is the largest retail trade group. It expects holiday sales growth will slow to a range of 6 to 8 percent. And this is compared to the 13.5 percent growth of a year ago. But why is the slump in Black Friday sales even important? The Black Friday weekend serves as an important indicator of the mood on the ground to gauge the willingness of the shoppers to spend. The two-month period between Thanksgiving and Christmas represents about 20% of the retail industry's annual sales. But here's the twist, rather a warning. Do not be fooled by the discounts that you see. According to consumer group Witch, analysis of more than 200 offers last Black Friday revealed something that you as a shopper must pay attention to. It found 98% were cheaper or the same price at other times in the year. And the consumer group is telling consumers Black Friday is rarely the cheapest time to shop. Let's face it, discounts are supremely attractive. There is no denying that. A discount tag is tempting. First things first, look at the price, not the saving. Research about the product and its price history. Ensure the sellers are genuine. Make a list of different retailers selling the same product. And goes without saying, money in your account is among the most important factors. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.